All right, man. So, I came across this crazy video on my TikTok for you page. Now, in this video, it's nothing but straight chaos and nonsense. Okay, I mean, it, it, obviously, it's another it's another black man attempting to be the victim of the situation. Now, the best part of this video, I never thought I'd say this in my 20 years of living, but the best part of this vid video was the comment section. I ain't never seen so many people, I'm talking about of all races, never seen so many people get together. I mean, literally, even society is divided, but I've never seen this many people get together since Biden came president and we all hated him, but let me get to the point. Uh, never seen this many people get together in a comment section and tell this Young black fella, like, yo, hey, bro, you doing too much. That white man is innocent. You're the one that's really, like, the white man is innocent. You're the one that's really dragging the whole situation. You're the one that's dragging the whole situation. In reality, the white man is the victim in the situation. You're dragging this whole situation. You're doing too much. You need to calm down. Bro, never seen this ever in my life. Never. So without further ado, man, we're gonna go ahead and get to the video. Hit the like button, subscribe to our post notifications. Without further ado, let's get to it. Racism Sir. is still real in Georgia. I can't what believe Bob tried me like that. My dinner? What was it you what was it that you was asking me before you interrupted me with my dinner? Because I turned it all the way down for you. Okay, but what was it that you was asking me? Is there a reason why you would ask me to turn my phone down when there's a band playing music that I don't give a fuck about hearing? Do you think it's appropriate for you to ask me, a 33-year-old, a black man, to turn his motherfucking phone down? You should know you shouldn't say a motherfucking thing to me. My hand shouldn't be shaking while I'm eating my motherfucking shit. Now what you better do is talk to do the do over there and leave me the fuck alone. Or ask another black man to turn his motherfucking phone down no time soon again. That junk is tough, man. That junk is tough, bro. You got, bro. Where you get it from? You gotta tell me where you get it from, bro. Don't, don't hold the drink. You gotta tell me where you get it from, cuz, bro. <laughs> I would tell you where I get it from, but I don't want you to steal my drip. You know what I'm saying? Cause your boy be drip. You know what I mean? I don't want you to steal my drip, man. Bro, come on, man. You, you a straight gatekeeper right now. Just tell me where you get the freaking jacket from, bro. I nobody wants to steal your stinky drip. You can't dress right. Nobody wants to steal your drip. Okay, you're dressed like you came from 1965. Nobody wants to steal your drip. Just tell me where you get the fire jacket from, okay? Please. <sighs> Fine, I guess I'll tell you. So, you know what I'm saying? I got it from a website, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's a dope website. It got jerseys. It got, I don't even know what you call it is, but this thing hard, you feel me? They got these. Oh, oh yeah, the website. <laughs> the website name is Fan Customs. You know what I'm saying? Fan customs, not fans with an S. Fan custom. See that fan? Like I'm a fan custom man. Junk is hard. You feel me? But however, uh, yeah, I got this from Fan Custom. You know what I'm saying? Like, like as you see, golden. You feel me? Right here we got JG to the DZ. You feel me? Oh, and then let me show you. Oh yeah, on the side, brother, we got Big Twenty. You know what I'm saying? Big Twenty. 
And I ain't talking about my age. I'm talking about the day I got married. Yeah, Fabi. Shout out to my wife. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, I got it from Fan Customs, man. All right, bro. You you doing too much with this jacket. <laughs> like, for real. Like, I got to tell you, boy. You was doing way too much. You know what I'm saying? Just, like, dog. Nah, okay, you told me where you got it from. Okay, cool. Is there like a, dis a, a discount code? How, how do I purchase the jacket? Like, I just want to purchase it. You got any discount code for your boy? What, like, what, 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 what you got? You hear what do you got, my guy? That's that's it. I just want to know what you got, my guy. Bro, I will tell you how you get one, but I really don't want to give you the sauce. But essentially, my brother, you know what I'm saying? You depend TV. I got to. You feel me? I got to tell you. Okay, so basically, how you get one of these is you type in fan customs, you know what I'm saying, on your computer or your phone. You feel me? And then when you type it in, you find what you want. They got all type of stuff. Like I said, bro, they got everything you know what i'm saying i got like what two things from before and bro it's all for the price of i ain't gonna lie i don't know what the, the, the price is cheap to me you know what i'm saying the price is cheap but if it is a little too expensive for you my brother because i <laughs> i know you're a broke boy you hear me you've been you've been off youtube for about two months <laughs> you got like what 50 cent in your account <laughs> That's a um but yeah uh, if you, you know what I'm saying, if you want to go ahead and get one of these, you feel me, you go ahead, type it in, you find your jersey, you find what you want. I don't really like you like that because you're conservative, but uh, type in code depend. Uh, not the code depend, but code DTV, you feel me, <laughs> you get 10% off your order, you feel me. Uh, yeah, that's how you pretty much get one of these, you know what I'm saying. I don't, I don't really mess with you, but um, yeah, just type that in and yeah. You get 10% off. 10% <laughs> off. <laughs> but, yeah, can you get out my room, though? Like, so I can go ahead and, you know what I'm saying, pop out in this. You feel me? Bro, I will be gladly to leave this room. It smells like fungus and feet in here anyways. Please, excuse me while I exit your perimeter. <laughs> yeah, whatever I said. There's so many things wrong in this situation, y'all. Racism is... I'm, hold on. Let me let me talk about this real quick. There's so many things wrong in this situation. Number one, number one mistake, um, sir. If you go like talk mess like that, and you know you you talking all big and tough, like you really go beat them up. Make sure you actually cutting your chicken the right way. I don't know if y'all seen it, but the man cutting his chicken upside down. I little like look look look. look let me. Show it's you still that. real in Georgia. So as y'all see, the fork, the chicken, the the knife is put in the right like in the right place. You know he holding it properly. Right here. No, I, I can't what believe Bob tried me like that. What was it? You, my dinner? What, was it you, what was it that you was asking me before you interrupted me with my dinner? And then he flipped it upside down. And started, I don't. I, I'm confused. And then on the other hand, number two, who eats chicken like that? I, I thought you just pick it up and bite it, but that's besides the point. That that's like that's so irrelevant. Um, okay. So, so far, my thoughts on this situation, and I want y'all to let me know in the comment section below what y'all think about the situation, too. This is crazy. And then I'm going to read the comment section and show y'all what the people are saying in the comment section because it's it's, it's beautiful. It is it is beautiful. I ain't never seen so many people get together. Like Even at my family reunion, they don't get together like this. This is amazing. Uh, But, yeah. So, my thoughts on this situation is, dog, number one, you're in a public restaurant. If you're going to be in a public restaurant, see, I am respectful for the ones that's around me. I'm not no big, obnoxious person. If I'm going to be watching something on, it's been times where I was at a restaurant by myself, just taking myself out, enjoying my food. I will be at the restaurant. I will sit there and watch some YouTube or I'll watch whatever, but I will always have my phone down to a minimum where only I can hear it. Because I can see how that could be very like your phone up loud and these new phones the new iPhones, like, I got the iPhone 14. This phone right here is loud, okay? Like, super loud. Like, these phones got some type of, I don't know what type of speakers they got, it, but these phones got some loud speakers. So, depending on what phone you have, it can be very disruptive to the people that's next to you, behind you, in front of you, because nobody wants to hear what you're watching. And if you're going to go into public and think that, oh, I'm going to watch my show, woo the woo Go ahead and bring you some headphones. How hard could that possibly be? It's not hard to get you some headphones. Obviously, you had enough money to order this food. So it's not hard to get you some headphones and listen to whatever you're trying to listen to. You're talking about, oh, it's a band playing this and playing that. Yeah, that may be true. It may be music playing and everything. But you got to understand, this is their business. 
it's not no other people that that don't belong in this store playing music. Like, no, this is their business. So yes, they're gonna play music for the people that want to hear the music. You know what I'm saying? But in that case, you go into a public restaurant playing your phone out loud. Just bring headphones, my guy. Or put it at a minimum, turn it down at a minimum where only you can hear where it's not disturbing their conversation or the people on the side of you or the next to you conversation. It's not hard. This is no racism in this at all. No racism. No right. Then you called the man Bob. It say racism is still real in Georgia. I can't believe Bob tried me like that. How would you like somebody call you James or not nah, not even James? Uh, what 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 what's a common black name? Um Rico, what is somebody, oh, I don't like how Rico tried me, like, it's like, bro, like, don't, you know what I'm saying, based off my skin color, don't name me what you think all white people are named, you know what I'm saying, like, I stopped calling white women Karens, because I just, like, bro, that's, like, just, like, I'm calling a white girl Karen, when she, her mother gave her a whole different name than just Karen, but I called her Karen because that matched up with white people, but I stopped that, I stopped that, I truly stopped that, because it's just, why? You know what I'm saying? Don't call the man Bob when his name is not Bob. That's the like 5,000 reason of what's wrong with this video. The 50,000 reason of what's wrong with this video. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro, I think you just was reaching. And it's crazy because if you go through, his, go through his page, he has a list of videos where it's like he's trying to play the victim. It's like he starts stuff, then he starts the camera when, the, when, when, when people that's not his color come in. And they try to escort him out and he'll try to tear down a company like, don't fly here and don't do this and don't do that. But what was you doing before the video even started? That's the real question. What was you doing before the video even started? You get what I'm saying? I'm sorry, I had to move my mic a little bit, y'all. Hold on, give me one second. All right, but yeah, what's, what was the real reason? You feel me? <clears throat> but let's uh, let's read the comments real quick. Let's scroll down. I got to uh, get my glasses. So if I if I mess up on some words, hey, 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 feel me. We need this video from when. Dang, I cannot see this. We need this video from when he asked to turn your phone down because this part not showing no racism. I hate people having loud phones next to me in public. Oh my gosh, they actually agreed. Confused, I am too. Uh, what to say? Uh, friend. That's how people spell friend nowadays. If y'all don't know, but friend, like the the. Fran, you 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 reached. You feel me? Basically, Fran, like you did too much. You know what I'm saying? Uh, is there another? Is there another part before this, or did I miss something? I'm a little confused. I don't see any racism as for the volume of the phone. Pat post one and a half. Okay, I I guess they're trying to say that they want another video or anything before this because I don't see nothing wrong with this. I'm sorry you had to go through this. How dare he tell you to turn your phone down while people are trying to enjoy their dinner? That was comp that was uh <laughs> that was sarcasm. That was very sarcasm because another thing that I didn't like about this was you threw you threw race in there. You said how uh how you gonna tell a thirty three year old black man to not like bro? Come on now, okay, we get it. You're black. Okay, we're, we we get it. Congratulations. He's a white man. He's looking at you like bro. What? I just asked you. Turn, can you please turn down your phone? And I'm pretty sure he didn't say, hey, folks, turn down your phone, G. Turn down your phone, bro. Hey, 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 turn down your phone, man. For real. Like, it's too loud. I'm pretty sure he probably said it politely to you and was like, hey, uh, excuse me, can you please just turn down your phone a little bit? And you probably just, uh, just based off your history of your videos, you probably took that to the extreme. You got to do better, bro. You got to do better. Somebody said, are you for real? Like, bro, is you dead serious right now? Uh, OP reminds me of my mom. My mom is the problem 99.8% of the time. Then she gets upset and pretends to be victim. That's exactly what he did. I believe that he was the problem and he pretended to be victim. Uh, that's valid at either get headphones or stay home. Better yet, maybe don't go to a restaurant with the live band. If you don't want to listen to the, to live music. Thank you. Bro, and the comments go on and on and on and on and on, like on and on, bro. It's so many people in the comment section that came together, bro. I ain't never seen a community of all people come together and go against one person. The fact that he do got, I did like the video to save the video because I wasn't going to put it in my save. So I did like the video, okay? So I know y'all see that little like right Yeah, I like the video because I want to keep it so I could react to it. I do that for a lot of videos. But however, now that I'm reacting to it, <laughs> let me go on ahead, unlike it. But anyways, um... Yeah, so that's the whole problem with this whole video. 
You know what I'm saying? It's a simple fact that you're dragging the situation, saying that it's racism. It's not racism, brother. He asked you to turn down your phone. Leave it at that. Turn down your phone. Be like, oh, yeah, man, I got you. Like, somebody asked me to turn down my phone in public, and it's loud, and they can hear what I'm playing, then that's a problem. Then I have to say, yo, uh, or I just be like, hey, my bad, man. I got you. I got you. Depend on how they say it. They say it politely, cool. If they say it all rude and nasty, knowing who I am as a person... I probably would still just turn it down because I don't like to argue with people. Uh, just don't like to argue with foolish people. People who don't have no home train. People don't have no common sense. People who think that they got to drag every single thing like this person. I just don't bother. Uh, but yeah, y'all let me know what y'all think about this in the comment section below. How y'all feel about this? I don't know why I still got my headphones on. But y'all let me know what y'all think about this in the comment section below because this is a ridiculous, a ridiculous thing to do. You know what I'm saying? A ridiculous thing to do. He said, oh, I didn't even see this. I didn't even see this. Y'all don't go look for problems, but um, but in Georgia, blacks and trans people are not safe. This art okay, bro. You using too many, too many NKs. I, I don't know all that, bro. But anyways, y'all let me know what y'all think about this in the comment section below. Um <laughs> talk about he don't score start problem, man. Please. Oh uh, yeah. I love y'all. I thank y'all for all the love and support lately on these last couple videos. Uh, I really appreciate every last one of y'all, man. God bless. Stay blessed. Peace. <laughs>